Hi, Cat Ploxworthy here with an OBS Studio Tech Tip. Have you tried to reroute your game's audio to a different virtual cable into OBS Studio only to not have it work properly? Or to work for one session then fail in the next? There is a plugin that can help with that, Wind Capture Audio. Instead of using the Windows Audio Pipeline, it captures audio directly from the applications you want to stream by way of an API introduced in Windows 11, then backported to Windows 10 versions 2004 and later. About the plugin. Wind Capture Audio is an OBS Studio plugin that captures audio directly from games and applications being streamed by way of a new API introduced in Windows 11, then backported to Windows 10 released 2004 and later. Requirements The plugin requires Windows 10 released 2004 or later, 20H2 is strongly recommended, or Windows 11 which contains a new API that the plugin uses. The plugin also requires OBS Studio 27.0.0 and later. It also bears noting that this plugin will not work with Linux or Mac OS, neither will it work with Streamlabs OBS, which does not support plugins. Obtaining the plugin. Navigate to the forum thread on OBS Studio's forums. There, there will be a download link that will send you to a GitHub page where there are two links, one that links to an installer and the other to a zip file for advanced users and portable users. We will be working with the installer as it will work for most users and all linkage can be found in the description below. Installing the plugin. When you run the installer, first thing you need to do is say accept the agreement. Then click next. Then verify to make sure that this is the correct directory where your OBS install is. If so, click next and then it'll verify whether you want to install that and then click yes. And then click next and then install. Once done, click finish and the plugin should be done installing. Using the plugin. To use the plugin, first of all, capture your video like you normally would. In my case, I'm going to be capturing Left 4 Dead 2 by way of the Game Capture plugin. In this case, we're going to capture a specific window and then tell it to capture Left 4 Dead 2.exe. Then click OK. Then we're going to add this one, the Application Audio Output Capture plugin. We click OK. We can name it at that point if we wanted to. Then we drop down the name of the application we want and select left 4 dead 2exe then click OK. Now if we want to monitor that right click in the mixer select advanced audio properties hit the drop down and then select monitor and output. And now we go back to the game and now you can hear the sound coming through the monitors. We can then click on single player back and that's all there is to it. Troubleshooting the plugin. Troubleshooting installation of this plugin. Double check which version of Windows 10 you're using by using the word WinVer in a command prompt or a run dialog, and then examining its output. The minimum required is 2004, and its recommended is 20H2. Windows 11 is also supported. Also, be sure to verify that you are using a supported version of OBS Studio, the minimum of which is 27.0.0. One potential solution is to uninstall previous versions of the Wind Capture Audio plugin to make sure that there are no remnants of the old version of the plugin. As a last resort, you could also try uninstalling all of OBS Studio, but please be advised that this will remove all of your third-party plugins and not just the ones bundled with OBS Studio itself. So you will need to restore all your other plugins to regain functionality of your system and potentially avoid crashes. Troubleshooting of operation of this plugin. Operational issues with the plugin can include heavy jitter 
after about after a while of using the plugin. The best way to sell, uh, fix that without having to kill the stream is to select away from that application's audio source to a different application and then select back. That should that should remedy the jitter. If you cannot capture audio at all, your game may be running as administrator, a classic example of which being Genshin Impact. The only solution to that is to run OBS Studio as administrator. Need help? You can find help by way of the OBS Studio forum dedicated to this plugin, but you can also find support at the developer's Discord server. I am also on that Discord server, and I will try to answer questions as I see them. Well, that'll about do it for that plugin. If you found this video useful, be sure to like it. And also, if you want to catch more of my videos as I make them, be sure to subscribe and to ring that bell right by the subscribe button so you don't miss a thing. Not just my videos that I upload periodically, but also any live streams I do here on YouTube. So thank you very much. I really appreciate your taking the time to watch this video. And bear in mind, this is beta quality software. As of this recording, it is beta 2.0.0 beta 3. So there may still be issues like the jitter I mentioned earlier. However, the Genshin Impact one, of course, that exactly can't exactly be fixed because, well, the program runs as administrator, so go gripe at miHoYo for that one. In any event, thank you very much for dropping by, and I hope you give the plugin a try. And if you have any questions, feel free to drop by the developer's Discord or mine. If you want general help, all the information is linked below in the description. Thank you for dropping by, and I hope to see you soon. Thank you, thank you very much, and talk to you later. Bye.